Outside today, you saw the snow falling. I asked students about their first encounters with the snow this year and what dangers may be lurking ahead. With students back on campus this year at WSU, some were surprised to see our first good bit of snow on Monday. Though it came as a surprise to some, others are veterans to the pal. I grew up driving the snow, so I'm pretty used to it. Ethan Robinson, a fourth year senior at Wazoo, is no stranger to the snow. However, even he has some concerns for the incoming wintertime weather. You know, the snow has good and bad. It's fun for about an hour, and then it's just cold. I think it's harder to get essential workers to do it for sure. I'm sure it'll be a kind of a high demand job, so people who are vaccinated, if it's a requirement, I'm sure they'll get paid pretty well if they're gonna do it. With the vaccine mandate in effect and many snow plowers losing their jobs, some worry about the Pullman atmosphere, especially with icy roads. As much as I love the snow, I really hate driving in it because you just slip and slide all over the place. And I don't have good brakes in my car and other people do and you're just slipping and sliding all over the place. Madeline Hepper is a sophomore at WSU who loves the snow. However, even she wants people to be aware of their surroundings on the roadway, especially when those surroundings are black ice. With the vaccine mandate by Inslee, uh, we had to fire a lot of people who were working the roads and plowing the roads. And because we don't have those skilled workers anymore, the roads are just not as safe. Um, I just wish drivers would be more careful in the wintertime in Pullman because there are pedestrians on the street. I think they need to plow more on campus because all those hills, you just are bound to slip. With little road maintenance noticed on Monday, who knows what the Pullman roads will look like once the snow really falls. With Barstool Wazoo posting their fair share of slip clips, it's up for debate as to what cars should expect in the next few months. Despite the snow being a wet, slushy mess now, once this ice freezes over, Pullman drivers are in trouble. Though most of it has melted away by now, students and staff got a good look of what the conditions might look like next semester. There's a lot of uncertainty on what might come in February and March, so let's hope the roads stay clear and not icy for as long as Mother Nature lets us. With Murrow News 8 in Pullman, I'm Will Wixie. Thanks, Will. Well, now that we know what the rest of the winter is going to look like weather-wise, let's see what the forecast is looking like for the rest of the week. Henry, what do you have for me? Eric, well, as you know, today it was snowing in Pullman. I took some video of what my walk to the class looked like today. You can see on the video just these thick, big snow, mm, snow just falling down on the ground. You know, as, as I was walking to class today, it started to pick up. And you know what? Throughout the day today, those um, snowflakes have just been getting smaller and smaller. And now it's starting to stick everywhere. Now, if you look at the rest.